Praise the Lord, everyone. Welcome to God's Hiller 7 channel. I'm Sister Barbara. Uh, welcome all my new friends and subscribers. I have a prophecy I'd like to share with you today. I got this prophecy back, uh, let's say, last week, uh, December uh, 28, 2013, uh, Saturday. And um, I kind of prayed on it all week. I felt like I was missing something, so I didn't want to go ahead and put it up. I felt like it wasn't finished. And then this, uh, this Saturday, yesterday, January 4th, 2014, I got three uh, visions that related to it. So you can join me now. <clears throat> I'm going to be in the New King James Version Study Bible. I'm going to be in, let's see, chapter 14. And I'm going to be reading, let's see, I'll, I'll just read 1 to 4. <clears throat> and the passage is called, Christ Comforts His Disciples. Let not your heart be troubled. You believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you, and if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you to myself, that where I am, there you may be also. And where I go, you know, and the way, you know. So this prophecy... Um, the first sentence uh, is what I had prayed on for most of the week. <clears throat> for the wages of sin is death. I am the way, the truth, and the life, eternal life. Since the beginning, sin has had its hold on man, but soon it will be no more. Come to me, seek after me, and you will find me. I am life. No more death, no more tears, no more pain or suffering. All will be wiped away, a new beginning. For my time has come. The mansion has been prepared for you. As it was written, so shall it be fulfilled. The mansion is ready. Soon the bride will be with her bridegroom. Choose life and live with the eternal. For my love endures forever. Come. So I was stuck on this. For the wages of sin is death. And um, as I thought about it and meditated on it, and I thought about wages, uh, wages are something you earn, and I thought, so um, I would have to say that, that this is what I got out of the sentence. Um, you just don't wake up every morning and say, gee, I'm going to be a sinner today. What happens is you, you work at it little by little. So um, it might just be something simple, like maybe you're not reading the scripture, or you miss a day here and there, and the next thing you know, um, you're not reading the Bible at all, or uh, you get uh, involved with worldly people, and maybe you're going places that you shouldn't be going, and you get involved with, with things there that you shouldn't be doing. And I guess you can see my point here. So it's a gradual uh, process of sin. It's not you start out today saying, I'm going to be a sinner, and this is how your day goes. It's a gradual process, and it's, uh, I want to say it's a very crafty trick uh, from the devil to get you um, off track and away from your Lord. So think about that. The wages of sin is death. You're earning it little by little and you're getting away from what you should be doing. Um, so again, I want to say repent and be baptized in the name of Jesus and you will receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. <clears throat> you read about that. Acts 2.38. And again, I'm proclaiming the acceptable year of the Lord from September from now until September 23rd, 2015, Yom Kippur, Day of Atonement. Uh, we have several videos up on that. And excuse my voice and my bloodshot eyes. I have allergies really bad. We're in the Northeast. It's been really cold and the heat has been running. And it's just uh, my sinuses have been killing me. So I'm going to upload the, uh, the related visions uh, next. And again, uh, God bless you all. And uh, I will be also uploading a video I'm going to be starting a fast, and I'm asking you to join me. I have it not, uh, listed on uh, the Facebook page and the, um, the YouTube page. The fast is going to be starting on January 7th, 2014. I'm doing a 40-day fast. And again, um, before you do anything like that, you should check with your health uh, care professional. Make sure that you're up to, up to that. Or you could just join me for a few days. And I will be letting you know what I do during the 40-day fast. And you could uh, work out your own plan for the um, fasting and praying. So again, God bless and tune in again. Amen.